again and I am going to do a get ready with me so you guys can see how do I get ready to walk Aria because I walk her literally two times a day because she's a big dog and she's 72 pounds I believe so she needs to walk she's not in the best shape I'm not gonna lie the first thing that I should do is not put sunscreen, but to put this in my head. This is not mine. It's my sister's. That's everything that I have is hers first than mine. Where I'm good. Okay, so the first thing that I do, I put screen. <laughs> I put sunscreen in my head in my head in my face okay this is my my this is my full english video like the first one that i'm gonna do let's see how that goes but just know that i'm nervous because english is not my first language it's actually spanish but i want to try like with the english version of my channel just to see if if i like it if i don't like it i'm gonna go back to spanish i feel like i'm gonna do both though whatever okay so i put sunscreen and I put more sunscreen like in all my bodies because I don't want to get burned <sighs> but yeah um I was gonna say dude guess what happened to me so <laughs> I was having lunch on Friday with my co-worker right um she just moved back to Austin she's from here and she's like, oh, I want some Mexican food. And you know your girl, like, I know some Mexican, good Mexican food place that. But it needs to be like fast place because like we were, we just have like an hour of lunch. Like it's not that we can go and sit in a restaurant and wait for a table and stuff. So I am like, oh, you know what? I know where to take you. Let's go to Cabo Bots. Delicious. I love that place. Like. One of my favorite place like if you like chipotle but i feel like it's like has better quality than chipotle so whatever i took her to couple buffs and i do my regular like three tacos with tomatillo tortilla whatever um uh, brisket like at this point she's like oh my god this chick is amazing she took me to couple buffs like we're having a great conversation right and you guys are never gonna guess what happened after we got our seats because you can sit like inside or outside right but the day was kind of good so i'm like okay you know what we should like sit inside like no sorry my bad <laughs> we should sit outside and i was like dude yes so we are like and looks like a picnic kind of thing like it's super cute like love it and we're enjoying our food i'm eating my taco i'm like do you like the food she's like yes because i am the type of person that's not gonna let you eat like i want to talk all the time so i was like do you like it like whatever right i can keep like i gotta shut up so dude i turn around and there is a bird on the floor. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, what? What happened? Like, is this like, is this thing bad? Like, is he okay? First concern, like, are you breathing? Like, are you like, is it air? Like, are you okay? Right? Obviously, he cannot like talk to me because he's a bird. He's a baby bird. And dude, my whole attention. Like, I couldn't eat my tacos anymore. I couldn't like do anything. I was just thinking about the bird. I was like, oh my God, this poor thing. He fell, he fell from the tree and he's gonna die. And like, there's nothing that I can do about it, you know? Because at this point I was like, I was saying my coworker like, dude, what, what are we gonna do? Like, and she's like, 
what are you gonna do? And he's like, I ain't gonna do nothing. <laughs> and I was like, well, but yeah, I mean, <laughs> and I mean, it's a bird and he's there and he, like, you can see it, like, he's really like, <gasps> <gasps> like, dude, I can, I can sense <laughs> that he was like in stress, you know, he's in a stressful situation. And I keep looking at the, like, up there, there was like two birds just like pooping, like, and I was like, bro, your kid, your kid is right here. Like, come get it. You know what I mean? Come get your kid, whatever. I cannot, like, I cannot focus on anything. I, I couldn't. I couldn't eat my tacos. I, I call, I call my boyfriend. I'm like, hey, babe, like, there's a bird here. Like, should I save it? He's like, you have a cat who literally hunts birds for a living. Because that's what Michael does. I'm so sorry, like. That's what he does. Um, you have Arya that it's gonna literally, oh my God, he's gonna literally leave not a single feather of the bird. Like she's gonna just kill him and, and that's gonna be it for him. Like you're gonna take him away from his like, you know, from his, I guess, three life, like from his house and you don't even know, if, like, if he's gonna survive. I'm like, whatever, you know what? Crushing my dreams, like, in the spot. I'm like, okay. I hang up. I send a text to the HR lady that works for work because um, she has, like, I don't know, she lives in the country and, you know, she's awesome. So I was like, dude, I found a tree. I, left. I found a bird and he fell. And she's like, live there. At this point, I already spoke with three people, my coworker, my boyfriend, the HR lady. And I'm like, okay, well, you all don't even know. Like, you guys don't even know what this poor bird is suffering. Like, my life is like, ugh, whatever. So, I, um, I know a guy who has like dogs and chickens and quail and you know, he's like super talented, everything like farm related stuff, I guess. I don't care, but I'm like, hey, there's a bird and he's gonna die if I don't do anything about it. So, what should I do? Guess what he told me. Guess what he told me. Leave it there. What? You're telling me to leave it there? Four people have told me at this time to leave it there. I'm like, oh, you know what? I am gonna listen to you all because you know sometimes you have to listen to people sometimes you have to be like oh, I understand I get it I get it I shouldn't be saving birds from trees and stuff and this poor thing I'm gonna, I'm gonna put a picture of the bird like right here but he was like he literally was suffering and now I'm never gonna go to Cabo Ops again because what if I go and the bird is right there and it's just gonna be like bones. And I'm gonna know. I'm gonna know that it was my fault because I kill it. Like, well, I didn't, but I was there to save him and I didn't. So, like I, that happened Friday, it's Monday and I cannot stop thinking about it. I cannot, like that bird, like I pray for him. God bless his heart, his soul, and everything. <laughs> because I couldn't save him. I couldn't, even though I wanted to, but I couldn't. But oh, yeah, that's what happened to me. Like I am traumatized, like for life now. I mean, I don't know what if he, I saw on Twitter that some brother birds and sister birds they like threw them off like they throw them away from the nest just to make like more space for them which i think is a little bit like what the like that's your brother that you're like kicking out of the nest but i guess i mean if that's the life that you want to leave as a murderer that's your story not mine but yeah I just, I cannot, I can stop thinking about the bird 
and about his life and everything that he could have accomplished going to Berk University and graduating and learning how to fly because I mean I could have fake him but they don't eat frijoles like or beans sorry they don't eat beans because that's what my taco had they don't eat brisket so like that was just I don't know I don't know I feel like a lot of responsibility was put on me by the Lord and I couldn't I couldn't I was a weak soul there I was like I can't set this bird but I guess life goes on life goes on and I have to keep pushing for all those birds I fell I couldn't make it it's okay I love it. I love it. Someone wants to go on a walk like right now. I don't know who. Oh. <laughs> I guess. So here's the outfit. I love it. It's really good. Kiss my face. Hello. I'm back from my walk. I just wanted to say thank you for liking subscribing and for everything that you guys do i am really really grateful <laughs> and yeah no i hope you guys are doing great and i see you guys in the next video